wonderful people. Thank you for coming to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Namaska. Not Nima Sopa, not Nima Sopi, or all of the above. But Namaska is what I chose, so that is what we are going with. Okay, so today, y'all are in for a treat because one, I am actually talking, and we don't have royalty royalty free music playing, but we are actually doing something. So today, we are going to look at a CC haul that I have done because I was just in the for custom content and it just needed to happen. So we have this lovely sim. Her name is Jay Hendrick and she is the model today. So I just hit random stuff with the what's the thing? The little dice at the bottom? Like three times and here she is. Okay, so I thought she was pretty to be looking if I just say so myself. So please just the fact that she doesn't have a skin on because I didn't download it when I was shopping for a haul and didn't find that out that I went to go look at what I got. But now it's okay though because we are going to look at the multitude of pairs that I decided that I need to get so that I didn't but for the sake of the haul we're gonna look. Okay, so first one we gotta have a little cap down, you know does that really happen? No, not really. Well we got the, the braid thing, so I feel like it's a staple. And then we got the bun on top of her head. But it has this weird clipping issue, so I don't really know what to do about that. But it was it could have been a nice well if you have that hairline thing that somebody made, it's on the center of resources, but the hairline thing that would fix that was wonderful. Okay, and then we got a basic spray. And then we got the wavy too. Let's see. I'm just looking right now. This is now the second time that I decided I was going to record this. So, I've already seen the footage. But we're going to go through all 20 minutes with you guys. Yay. So, on this one, you can change the color of the headband. That's convenient because when you got a blue outfit and headband, it comes in gray. That doesn't necessarily work all the time. But, for this one, you can change it. <laughs> Isn't that convenient? Yay. And you got this one. That one looks like the what's the vintage glamour thing, like a remake of that. But I like that. I think it comes with a flower. And am I right? We shall. Can she find it? Yes. No. Maybe. Okay. This is just me watching my past self trying <laughs> to get this right. Okay. I don't know if I ever found it, but we can't. Oh, there's a flower. Peekaboo. Yay! There it is. Okay. So. We zoom out, spin it to the side, zoom back in. Okay, so I guess we can ask y'all, how y'all just going? Mine has been going pretty well, if I do say so myself. I have to go back to because Hurricane Julian has been working my last nerve for the past four days, messing up my whole schedule, but I guess that's okay. And just for all you kids who are still in high school, just know that it gets better. Because I used to hate going to high school, but now I can't wait to go. I, I actually like my college, my classes in college. Who knew? So if y'all want any advice on what you would do in high school or what college is like, I am here for you guys. So feel free to put in the comments if you made it this far in the video. That would be pretty cool. But put it in the comments if you got this far. Okay, so back to the video. We got this hair. Which is a whole lot. Tell me if you can see your sim wearing that hair. I think it's nice, but there's just a lot going on. And there's this one. She's pretty cute, I guess. Ooh, and then we got the pro hawk. That's so cute. If any of y'all have an opportunity to wear that from Absolutely Blue, it's just magical. And I recommend it for everyone. Please excuse my lack of mesh. We really love the question marks and the bright front front. The sim, but sometimes the camera cannot be controlled. <laughs> and in that instance, she just came to the party and wasn't even invited, but that's fine. Because we improv our way through things. Alright, and I'm still. Oh, wait, this one has flowers. It's so cute. Just know if you ever decide to make YouTube videos that flowers make your sim so hard to crop out of the picture. Or they just really want to mess up the hairstyle, but. Two simple hairstyles is what I'm getting at. 
And there's another mohawk esque style. And that was just like wavier. And then we go back to the long hair. How many long hair hairstyles are we gonna get in this uh, custom content series? Well, I feel like they kind of like they keep coming out with new stuff. Well, I guess there's some. Uh, there's so many more variations of long hair than I thought there. So I guess and on that one, the ears are clipping. I guess she has some big ears. So the big stick, so I think the hair works. I don't know if I went. There it goes. You can't see the ear. Oh my! You can see your everyday skin wearing that. Yeah, okay. And then we got the hair thing on. I don't know if you can change it. I don't even think I go out to look. But it has a headband for all the young fans who require one. Oh, and also, if you have seen some of my other videos, I'm trying to work on content for you guys. So, I figured I would just do, like, TV show recreations, you know? And I thought that would be pretty cool. I don't want to do, like, actual people, though, because if, there's some people who get celebrities very accurate in the face hair, in the face. You know, when you look at a sim, you're like, yes, that is Harry Styles, or yes, that's Beyonce. I don't have that baby. So, <laughs> we're going to use, like, animated ones. For example, like I did, Brett doll. Maybe we can throw in a Barbie. I don't know. Tell me if y'all are team Barbie or team Bratz. Because Bratz was where it's at. Thank you very much. Barbie was a bunch of foolishness. Try to convince me otherwise. Because Bratz was absolutely, the big heads and all were great. Absolutely great. I just love the fact you couldn't get the shirt over their head. You had to take the head off to try to put on a shirt. If it didn't have a little Velcro in the back. See, Bratz was my childhood. I had the little RV and everything. I was the kid who played with a Bratz doll in the Barbie play. Because <laughs> that's just how we roll. So that's fine. Okay. So on this one, back to the hair. Because as you can see, I have a crazy my hair compared to the rest of items that I decided was appropriate enough to download. And then I also realized that I only talk, looked at adult women. I had stuff for kids too, but they didn't make it in there. That's fine. Y'all well, didn't want to see kids. We can do a separate one for kids and men. Because men are so underrepresented. Which, what's that thing? Which life, life, age, like, which age group do you feel like is the most underrepresented? I would have to say between male kids and probably male fathers. Babies don't even get a chance. And Sims 4, maybe Sims 5, we'll see. But, speaking of Sims 5, what do y'all feel like the Sims 5 would be? Like, what else could they add? So there's so much more they could add. As far as the graphics go, I feel like every odd brand has only been two odd Sims. Sims 1 and Sims 3, but they were so ugly. Like the Sims, Sims 2 Sims were my jam. And Sims 4, I like the fact that I can actually get custom content. Sims 3, I don't know why, but it, I don't think Sims 3 just wanted me to have custom content. But now, I can open to the world and I suggest the talk, well not suggest, but I recommend custom content forever. If you haven't, okay, so. Currently, I started with a laptop, and I mean, the, the game didn't run the smoothest, but the hairs were not, you didn't have to care about the, each pack that you had, but that's some content change, and your sense could still be cute without every pack. Well, I mean, there's some custom content that requires packs, but there are also some that are base game compatible, so if you see BGC on any Tumblr post, that is what that means. Oh, and if you are looking for anything you see in the video, it will be in the description below. Okay, so the reason I am candidating, not that that's the verb or anything, but the reason that, the reason that I feel the need to go on tangents is because while I filmed it the first time, I kept being like, oh, so we got this one. Oh, so nice and straight. This one is slightly less straight. Oh, this one is wavy. Wow, ponytail content but then 
as I kept thinking, and I was like, 20 minutes in the video, I was like, what? He just said, okay. Like, you see, and I can see that that's the hairstyle, and I don't really feel like y'all need me to tell. Well, y'all need to tell y'all that's the hairstyle. So I figured y'all can hear me talk. <laughs> Voice over are just great. Oh, speaking of, like, talking. In one of my classes, they require that, okay, so, we have the option between a speech class, a class where you spoke, or you presented with a PowerPoint, and it was just all about you presenting. And we had this other class that was called Intro to Communication. So, that, I chose that one because that was the only one that I didn't have to public speak in. <laughs> that's great for someone who really wants to be, to be able to public speak. But that's fine. We'll get across that bridge when we get there. So if y'all have any advice for public speaking, other than do it, that would actually be very helpful. If y'all have read any books that helped y'all, help a girl out, please. <laughs> because I'm trying to work on it, but the nervousness get like I want to be like I'm okay with being nervous that I can public speak, but it just the delivery is not the best, as you can probably see from here. When I, even if I'm just sitting in my room by myself. And it's still not smooth, so if y'all have any tips, that'd be absolutely wonderful. Okay, so back to what I forgot what I was talking about. Hold on. So anyways, so I took the class to avoid public speaking. And then, oh yeah, so I took the class to avoid public speaking, and then the lady added a speech at the end, but it wasn't that bad, because we could record it, and we could refilm it as many times as we wanted to, and just submit it online. And the thing was supposed to be two to three minutes. And this girl over here at me, I'm referencing myself if you haven't caught on yet. But I decided that I was going to take six minutes to talk about what I wanted to talk about. No one good. I don't even know if it was relevant. But I did okay on the. I got an okay grade. Passed the class. So I guess it wasn't too bad. But all I know is. It would have come out completely different had I done it in front of people. And I was in my room and I had to re-record that thing like four times. By myself. I felt bad for my roommate, but she didn't complain. That was great. Well, I like this. Okay, back to the hair. I like this hair because it's great. Like, at first I was like, ooh, that's a little, a little rough. But then, I've warmed up to it now as I've seen it like five times. So... No custom content. The first impression is not always good. Now I like this one. It's a little House on the Prairie vibe. And you can have a little scarf. And you can change the scarf. Isn't that just exciting, guys? <laughs> I hope you're entertained. If you're still entertained by this point, bless your soul. Because voiceovers are not my strong point, as you can tell by the royalty stream music that you have seen in the past couple videos. And to be honest, I kind of contemplated not doing this video, or not redoing it, or just put some slapping some royalty free music on this one. I said no. I gotta get, I gotta start somewhere. So here we are. And okay, I have a question for you guys. So if you happen to record with OBS, how do you get well record and record audio, like the video and the audio at the same time? How do you get it to? for me and for the whole video to show up. Like, do y'all have this problem? Today is the first day it happened and I reconverted that thing like six times. Nothing happened. So, we're here because determination is a thing. I've been watching self-help videos for probably the last hour. <laughs> so I figured I had to accomplish something. So we're here. But I actually do enjoy it. And I do enjoy the Sims a lot. I spend absolutely too much time. Well, I figured this channel would be a way of making my Sims playing productive. And maybe I could enjoy it with you guys. Because obviously there's an audience for the Sims. So, I figured that we can play together. We can have a good old jolly time. If they make the multiplayer one day. Which I probably... I don't know how I would about that. Turn on your internet. Some of y'all are falling. Some are on the whims of the college Wi-Fi. 
sometimes. <laughs> Referencing myself again. So, if they didn't make the most, is that something that y'all would be into? Is that, like, would y'all care at all? Would y'all, would it bother y'all? Or would it add anything to your game that makes sense multiplayer? Like, you can mess with other things. But I feel like that's when those mods where you can kill people and <laughs> you can, like, the, what's that mod? Well, whatever. It's used to, like, kill other sins. It's not NC Command Center, but the other ones, like, where you can shoot somebody. Like, those mods, I feel like once you start doing that, that other people's sense. That's where it's all over. So, <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Sims 5, maybe? Yay, we don't know. Okay, and another thing Sims New. I saw today where they had a thing. Well, not today. I saw yesterday where I was watching Little Simsy's video and she was crying over stairs. <laughs> and I was thinking to myself, I don't think I would ever cry over stairs. But I mean, it just shows, goes to show the passion that she has for the Sims and I respect her. Respect the hustle. But do y'all think that stairs are actually revolutionary? Well, L-shaped stairs are revolutionary to your game. I feel like, okay, I'm not much of a builder because one building takes way too long for me, and I try to do the most every time I build something. So it's not required, and I feel like it's up looking ugly anyway. So I figure I should stick with cast, and I'll just link the stuff. Oh. That, oh wait, that, okay, so, finish this point. So, I figured that I would just link you stuff in the description. But this time, for this video, I decided, hey, you need to get your Tumblr together because the descriptions are going to be a little long. Especially for this video because I actually, well, not actually, but what I'm supposed to download each month, but I downloaded 200 items to add to my Sims game. Hopefully y'all are still enjoying at that point at this point, so that's fine. But I downloaded that too many items to depth to all link in the description. So I figured that I would make it look okay. So my Tumblr, she's not that cute, but she's more functional than she was. So go look at my Tumblr if you need links to the things you see in the video. And I mostly did hair, because that's what I mostly got, but if there's something, like if there's a shirt you're just dying to have, and you say, the mask if you wear, I don't see it, on your Tumblr, please leave it in the comments, and I shall be sure to get back to you with that shirt. Because people have done this to me in the past, where they say, okay, so I'm not going to call them out, but there's a sp specific person who had some cute pajama pants on there, them, and then they were like, oh, I'm gonna put it in the Tumblr. And I went through all 500 pages of their Tumblr and could, still couldn't find a pen. So, a little salty, but that's fine. I've gotten over it, and I've gotten a peep. <laughs> but I was really set on those pants, but then I kind of figured I would just get if you want them that bad, you probably could just Photoshop them and stuff. But I'm not that skilled at all. Okay, so back to CC on the topic of CC making. I have a huge respect for those who make CC. Or CC stands for custom content. I guess I could have specified that earlier, but we're here now, so it's custom content. So the people who make it, I have a lot of respect for them. I because you can tell. Like it takes well, I don't know if it takes them a long time, but I feel like it would take me so long that it would just like you would have to look like I would expect people to love you to people. Which is not really fair in hindsight, like when looking at it. But like you put so much work in my blood sweat and tears into that shirt that everyone is now wearing. But that's why it's not for me and neither is Jill. I feel like it feels cute and stuff. But it's just not like the quality I see of other people, like you're not supposed to compare yourself, you don't compare yourself. But I'm just looking like I made a house. I feel like apartments, I'm be I feel like I'm better at furnishing than building the shell. So like the little challenges people make, I feel like those would be, I, those would be great. But I have to color, find stuff in different color schemes, and that's the issue too. But once I get the color scheme, I'm good. 
Because I'm always going to resorts to like tan or beige. Like it's a good looking room, but it's all beige. And I can't ever, I can't ever, I can't ever pick a paint color to save my life. Do any of y'all have this issue? I say I can build a cute room, but they have so many issues. <sighs> but like paint color stress me out because like you don't want them to be too matchy matchy. But then, if they don't match, you're like, why do you have a red wall and the rest of your furniture is pink? Like, what? The story of my life. I mean, unless you want a Valentine's Day house, then that'll be fine for you guys. Okay. So, another thing that I was thinking about that just popped in my head are these cats. So, I'll let y'all know right now, as of currently, I don't have all the cats because. I refuse to get paid full price for all of these packs. And I'm so happy that they come out with all this content. But content ain't free. And the more content they come out with, the more behind I am, I am with the pack. So usually I wait till Black Friday and I get all the on sale. So, I mean, if y'all trying to save some, save some money. But like, I can be without mermaids for a couple months. Like, they, I don't feel like they would really. Especially since I'm more in the calf region, anyways. I don't, ooh, excuse that word. As of right now, mermaids are not essential to my well being and the sense. So, I'm feeling pretty darn good about not having mermaids right now. I mean, Sulani looks great. I like that world. Oh, another thing. Okay, so, tangent again. Can we just talk about, like, these YouTube? YouTube. Can we talk about SimTubers, like, reactions to videos versus, like, their first, like, after they get back from whatever, or wherever the Sims send them? Because, like, on the trailer video, trailer reaction videos, they're all like, yay, this is the best thing ever, new content for the Sims. And the first video, you're like, oh, this is so basic, like, we don't need this, blah, blah, blah. I.e. my first pet stuff, like, everyone was okay with it at the trailer, and then now everyone hates it. Like, and I feel like that's pretty consistent across, like, all, not all, but a majority of the pack. Like, every, like again, people are excited, but then they, like, shut it down. Like, just, they completely discount the pack after, like, a month of playing with it. And I was like, where's the initial excitement? Like, you're so optimistic. And I'm just like, oh, this sucks. Okay. So, we are now coming to the end. Of this video, I hope this was not educational at all <laughs> concerning the custom content. But we are here, we made it to the end. Thank you. If you have made it to the end, you are an awesome person, and I appreciate you so much. But as we look at this lovely dress here, I think I'm going to go now. So <laughs> remember, it is the masterpiece. If you would like, if you like my commentary, consider subscribing, that would help me a lot, and that would make me very happy. Y'all have a wonderful day. Thank you very much.